Oh, this is just a quick one. Some breaking news on the uh, Fury Usyk fight. Uh, after the uh, public workouts yesterday, Team Usyk weren't happy with the canvas. They're saying that the stitching wasn't right. I think it's like a millimetre too deep or something like that. So it's going to have to be re-examined, maybe replaced. And yeah, so it, it could be holding up the fight. And it is quite ironic that when Fury was fighting Klitschko, he had the same problem. But Klitschko was making the canvas spongy so that Fury couldn't move around the ring. And obviously Klitschko had been training in sand, so he was used to stepping, uh, moving around on, like, on, a, on a spongy canvas because he was doing a lot of training in sand. So, um, but this, to be fair, this is quite, quite different because their uh, team used to say it's a trip hazard, so it will be bad for both fighters. But um, just to explain it a little bit better, is the is here's the Sky Sports. Is this just sorry? Is the Sky Sports breaking news? Explaining it all. So just have a listen, guys. Really, really interesting development to share with you now live on Sky Sports News. I've been told that Team Usyk have actually complained. They're not happy, would you believe this, with the canvas on the ring and specifically the joins in the canvas. Now, the way boxing rings for these big fights are manufactured is the rings are erected and then the canvas that you see with all the sponsors' logos on the floor, it's in six foot panels and they are sewn together with a, a seam that's maybe a millimeter deep. Now, member of Team Usyk looked at the canvas last night at the open workout where Usyk seemed fairly happy inside the ring. He had a look at the canvas and it was his thought, his concern, it may be a trip hazard on the night. So they've got to come down here and have a look at the identical canvas on the actual ring. I mean, Fraser, we'll go and have a look at the ring in a little while. But first of all, give us your reaction onto that. Is this just my... So they're trying to say it's mind games and all that kind of stuff. Like, I'd just like to put it out there. My opinion, I, think it, I don't think it's mind games. Because if this is an issue, it affects both fighters. Uh, when Klitschko was making the canvas spongy, it absolutely was mind games and he was trying to take Fury's legs away. Like I said before, he was training in sand, running in sand and stuff like that. So he was used to a, a soft spongy canvas and he knew that Fury was going to move around. So it what with the Klitschko, Klitschko, it was mind games. I don't think um, Usyk is that type of guy. He's just a phenomenal, phenomenal kind of fighter who's totally focused. He don't he don't play mind games. He don't he don't he's not he's not involved in all that kind of business. Psyching people out mind game business. Usyk's just a fighter. He just like he, he just he just loves fighting, loves bo well, he's a boxer obviously. He just loves boxing, training and he's super focused. So yeah. Well that's it. That's the breaking news guys. I'll keep you updated. Hopefully this won't hold up the fight. I really hope not. It, hopefully just change the flipping ring. If he's not happy and it's not safe, just bloody change it. All the money that's there. All right, guys, Boxing Bros UK, please subscribe.